What's up, everybody? How you doing? Bobby Simmons is in the building. And as you can see, in the place to be, sitting directly next to me, ladies and gentlemen, it is the one and only Cherokee is in the building. What's up? What's up? <laughs> My Brooklyn homegirl is in. The, you still Brooklyn, though, right? All day. All right now, because I mean, no, no disrespect. You always I, make me feel so welcome. Thank you. Well, well you, you're my peoples. You're my Brooklyn peoples. And though you're on the West Coast now, shout out to the West Coast people because we have out. lots, we have lots of friends on the West Coast. Absolutely. But we screaming, "Go Brooklyn, go, go Brooklyn. Brooklyn!" That's what we have right Brooklyn. now. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. You are making always. your rounds. Yep. As your song, your single is "You Are Goddess." A Goddess. Yes. Uh, you are in the building. I thank you so much for taking the time to come. Hang out, and we're gonna talk a bit. You got a few minutes to hang out with me, right? I hope Absolutely, you do, cause yeah. we people. That's why I'm here. I be hitting <laughs> Cherokee up on on Facebook. You know what's funny? And we're gonna talk about this in a little bit. We family, and we talk to each other on Facebook. Don't we? Don't we got each other's numbers? Yeah. Why are we talking yeah. on Facebook all the time? I know, right? It's like we can just <laughs> we can text just each easily other. pick up the phone. You know, you know what I'm saying? We do like, more texting than anything. E exactly. So. We, we gotta wrote, change that for 2019. Well, yeah, we, we definitely. Yeah, yeah. well, I know, I know, I'm gonna have to. We gotta change that. Yeah, I know I'm about to change that too. <laughs> Look at that Facebook. I love y'all, and I will see y'all some more. But too much chatting. I know. Too much chatting. <laughs> I've been thinking about like slacking up off of it a little bit. I'm more on Instagram. Oh well, you know what? Tell I you am. what. Tell you what. Tell you what. Hold I on. Cherokee's in the building. <laughs> She's not drinking. No, I don't. She don't drink. drink. I don't drink. And I, I and I want to say this before we go. Because I'm going to get some endorsements, for real. We're going to get some endorsements, because this is good. It smells good, though. This is good. <laughs> and, uh, you know, because we are, now in, we are now in 2019, and, you know, we're saying Happy New Year's to everybody, because a lot of great things. But w when we come back, I'm saying that to say that we're coming back. We're going to come back with Cherokee. We're going to talk in a few minutes, and we're going to talk about what you just said about social media. So yeah. don't disappear, y'all. My Brooklyn friend is in the building. The hey. one and only, as Earth, Wind, and Fire say, Verdine. <laughs> Sun Goddess is in the building. Y'all don't disappear nowhere. Check it! <laughs> Done. Woo! <laughs> I'm telling you, Cherokee. I'm missing out. Well, I mean, nah, nah, but it's good, but it's good, though. Right. Bobby, <laughs> Bobby Simmons is back in the building with my special guest, Cherokee is in the building. And let's, let's get to start. Let's talk. Let's start talking. First of all, again, thank you for coming here to hang out tonight. And I want to come back to what you just said a few minutes ago. Now, you said you're going to slack up off, off, of, Facebook. off of Facebook. Yeah. Now, 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 tell me why, and I explain to you why I think I'm going to still go head on. 
Actually, I'm on Instagram a whole lot more right. than I am on Facebook, mm. and I get a lot of DMs, and I actually like the one-on-one -on -one conversations more. You okay. Know? I have a few people that will hit me up, mm -hmm. and I don't mind people saying, let me get your number, let's, let's talk, let's chat, and that's what I do more. Right. You know, I've been like letting people, I give my number out now, you know, I'll chat more with people and try to do a one-on-one -on -one thing. Right, okay. You know? But Facebook, it's like, it's. I do Facebook more with the family, mm -hmm. you know, but with like fans and other artists, I like to do Instagram. Oh, cool. That's cool. Yeah. No, because Instagram is definitely a place where you can gather a lot of people. Yeah. The reason why I was saying that is because, because of the fact Facebook is definitely now becoming more of a, uh, a network. Right. Because now you can watch television, movies, people creating their own shows. Very true. You yeah. know, That's why I watch Jada. Like, like Jamie Foxx, my yes. friend Jamie Foxx, how we had that discussion <laughs> and all of a sudden, that's all right because right, my check went too. We right. there. <laughs> but, <so. laughs> yeah, I watched the Red Table on it. That's my favorite show. Right, so. exactly. Or, yeah. or, right, there you yeah. go. So it's really becoming more of that now. Right. You know, so, so in other words, you just you, you like more the connection on Instagram than you right. do. Right. Perfect, perfect. Because yeah. we just want to make sure we don't want to lose you on Facebook. Oh, no, you can I'm not going nowhere. No, no, no. I'm good. still staying there. Good, yeah, good, good. How there. you been, though? It's been such been a good. minute. I've been good. I'm enjoying the single being out right now. You right, know, right. People are feeling it. So right. Tell us good, a little bit about it. It's called, it's called Goddess, right? It's called Goddess. Mm -hmm. Right now it's on uh, Spotify. And um, on basically on all the you know all the uh, platforms out there, right. it's on um, iTunes, so people can purchase it. They can get it. go get that, go cop that right now. That's right. <laughs> see, that's that Brooklyn in there. You see, it came out. Yeah, Our West Coast. <laughs> yeah, they can get it. So you know, it's real good. The video is done. Right. So that was really good. It was directed by um, Rashidi Harper and Sequoia Emmanuel, right. which is a she's a photographer. She's a new director, so right. it's pretty cool. I'm excited. Now, 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 tell us what took you a minute to come out with something because you had some out a while ago but it excuse me it took you a minute to to return back is it because the industry is cluttered and you don't want to get in a in a crossfire with what's going on music or are you just an artist like I do what I do in time it's a little bit of that too but I think it's more so of um just really being family being you know delving into my family mm -hmm. you know I just took a break because I have two kids and, right you know, yes and they're mm -hmm. now 14 and 12 wow so that is like my number one priority right. is being there for them you know and just not being present because mm -hmm. it makes a difference right. I don't want to ever look back and regret like not being there oh no know? definitely definitely, definitely. So, so that's the biggest thing for me so what what do your, your, your two children think about mommy being in music business like it's is this exciting to them it is, but then it's like, no, nah, it's just mommy. Hmm. You know, they haven't really seen me do my thing. What? They've only seen, like, little hints, like the tape, or they see, like, videos, but they've never been to a show. Wow. So they not, yeah, they, they don't know. Yeah, they need to see you really do <laughs> yeah. your thing. They don't know. And, yeah, know? well, people don't know, too, but that. But I think it's good that they don't, because when they finally see it, they'll be like, okay, mommy. Yeah, yeah, you know? <laughs> yeah. I mean, but you don't, well, you're mommy, so for, first things first. Mommy's yeah. first. Yeah. Uh, entertainment is second. So exactly. So the, the yeah. mommy is the first thing. Yeah, but, but they're, I'm sure proud. When, they're yeah, proud. When they see you, they're going to be like, wow, I didn't know that mommy can... What exactly. people don't know about Cherokee, I'm, I'm going to you know, put it out there right now. <laughs> Cherokee play bass, right? I, I dibble-dabble. You don't know dibble, no dabble. <laughs> you play bass. I dibble-dabble. <laughs> see, and I'm going to tell you something, because one time we, we, we was doing a show. We was doing, um, oh my goodness, I can't remember what it was. Uh, it was Nile Rogers Festival. Mm -hmm. And I said, Cherokee, you think you can make it here to play bass with us? We need a bass. You was busy though doing something. Right. Because I know you would have came through for us if, yeah. if we needed someone to play bass. Because I automatically thought right. you play bass. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, so, so how long have you been playing bass? I've been, I actually have been playing on and off. Mm -hmm. So I've been playing since I was a teenager. Right. Yeah, on and off, though. So, I've, I've never been, like, consistent with it. You mm -hmm. know, I'm really more of a, um, like, if you play something, I can pick it up. No, oh, so you, yeah. you actually, you, you self-taught yourself. I, yeah, I'm, I'm actually, I play by sight mostly. Okay. But I've taken a few lessons here and there, but mm. mostly like to learn funk stuff. Right. I don't really have the patience to sit and like learn how to read and everything, even though I did it in school. Mm. I did I did upright for two years, you know. Right. But I don't have the patience. What I need to do is really sit down and start like again mm. and learn the patience and, you know, learn how to read because that would be, I think it would help me overall. Right. You know? But it, I like funk. That's what I like. Yeah, exactly. yeah. I was going to say too, do, do you think that... Uh, that helps you even today not reading music? Well, obviously, we can say, yeah, because look at the entertainment out today. 
Right. You know right, what I'm saying? Yeah. None of them can read nor sing. Exactly. You know? Yeah. Yeah. So you're matter. in an easy chair. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, and it's so funny because I stay on my daughter because she plays piano, and I'm mm-hmm. like, no, you got to learn how to read. You got to. She takes lessons and she gets lazy with it, but I stay on her because I regret mm. not sticking to it. You know? Right. But you think she she could pick up though? She could pick up and be quick she with can. it, right? Yeah. Yeah. She can. Yeah. yeah see? She's good. But, She's been playing since she was four. Yeah. So that's ten years. Does she listen yeah. to your music though? <laughs> she does. Yeah. Like she like, does. like I'm gonna ask you something. Yeah. Do, do she listen to songs like I swear? You know what's crazy? Her favorite is my very first album. Really? Yeah, and then yeah. and the new stuff that I'm working on. Okay, she's well, heard, of course now. She's yeah. heard the second album as well, but she likes uh, more of the live stuff. Right, right. You right. know, which is I think that's great. Yeah, yeah. You know? it teach, it, uh, again, it teaches uh, the, the the kids that the fun and excitement that they can get out of music. Right. Uh, actually playing and right. not letting the computer, you know, really exactly. design everything for them. Exactly. You know? So is, is this pretty much what this new stuff is really about, a lot of live instrumentation and stuff? No. No? It's not. No? <laughs> yeah, the, the new stuff is not. It's Some of it is live, like the guitars, mm-hmm. you know, I have a little bit of bass, but it's not. It's more like um, the second album, but still different. You mm-hmm. know, I have a lot of different sounds on there. Oh. People will hear it and they say, oh, it sounds like this person or that person, but... I've always been like a melting pot, mm. you know. I don't think I have one particular sound, and I think that has been a positive and a negative, mm. you know, for me. So, no, but do you think? Do you think that? Because uh, I don't want to say electronic too much of electronic. I say it's drum machine, drum machines, and you know, keyboards. Mm. But we do have live guitar, right, right, right? And we do have live bass, right? You know, and we do have live percussion actually. Okay, on a, on a few songs. So, so, so. Do you put a little of that old school method into your music today? Oh yeah, you know because <laughs> because I, I say that because yeah. we need the music to shift, right? You know, uh, particularly new music, and yeah. I'm not saying you because I've, I've as long as I've known you, I've never seen or heard you follow anybody else. You mm-hmm. always stayed in your own path in your yeah. own zone. I will say this though, I said this to you before, because <laughs> we're both huge right. Prince fans. Right, of course. You know yes. what I'm saying? Yes. And you know, I told you this before. Right. That I swear, <laughs> that's that's right. that's that's a Prince vibe yeah. song, right? Everybody there. says that. Yeah, yeah. And, but but it's I take that as a compliment. No, and no, yeah. I'm saying you should because yeah. it's not like somebody listens to it and is like, oh, she's trying to sound like Prince. No, right. it's like uh-huh. you you understood musically what he was doing. Right. I don't want to say trying because he wasn't trying to do nothing. He right. was doing. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. that's how we learn. We say, okay, don't be afraid to do. Right. And that's what you did. And that's the reason why we loved it. Right. Because exactly. of the fact that you were doing it. You weren't biting him. You were right. just like. Nah. You heard everybody in that song, and right. because because it, it was so almost what they I guess people would call almost Prince familiar. You gotta say no, 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 because you hear Larry in there too. Right. You hear Larry Graham. You hear right. all the funksters. Right, exactly. That I mean, you, that's what I grew up listening to. You exactly. Know what I mean? So that's gonna automatically be a part of who I am. Exactly. You know, I get lots of different comparisons. Some songs people say, "Oh, you remind me of Janet," or "Oh, you remind me of Badu," or you know, I get all these different comparisons. But I'm cool with it all. Right. Yeah. Because I love everybody. Yeah. You know? But you, you throw it in, and, and let's let's be clear with everybody too. You have your own style. Absolutely. You, it's not that people yeah. can listen to it and go, oh, oh right. you, no. People know you have your own style, right, absolutely. and I think that's why uh, what you do, even with God, is not it all works for you. I think my voice is distinctive too. I don't think I sound it is. my my vocal it is. is different. You it know? is. I have a low register. Yeah, even low register. I can go in a high. I still have. My of course voice, you can. Because I was talking to you on the phone one time, and I said, I said, yo, you don't think you you should sing that? I swear in a higher range. And right. He's like, really? I'm like, try it. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And right. you know, maybe don't. But it's yeah. like I I am such look. Let me get back to Brooklyn homeboy and homegirl family because I get excited <laughs> knowing the kind of work that you do because I'm proud of you. Thank I'm very you. proud of you. I watched what you do from the beginning. Yo, hold on real quick. What's so funny is that the first time I interview you, <laughs> oh my goodness, it was almost 25 <laughs> years so ago. so long ago. It was oh like almost God. 20. And I remember, and <laughs> so I still got that. It was, I might pop that up someplace. I think in I there. got it too somewhere. <laughs> it, was, it was the and You were that person then and you're still that person now. And since that moment, I've, I said, no matter what you do, well, I mean, it all depends because, you know, I have a talk with you or Cherokee right. while you do that. But right. it never got to that point. You've oh, always oh. done yeah. what you love to do. Yeah, absolutely. And I will continue continue to support you on it, even though I still, I still, when I watch that ooh, wee, wee video, I be looking at it, she be like, ooh, baby, ooh, wee, wee. I'm like, yes, <laughs> doing that thing. <laughs> That's so crazy. I love it. It's like you. It's crazy because people love that song. Yes, like, you don't love, like you don't like doing that song no more. No, I I like the song, but it's like I never wrote that song for me. 
No? No, I wrote that song for TLC. And then that's the right, label I was like, uh, right. no, you're going to keep that song and we're going to, you know, that song is a hot song. Right, right, right. So that's how that all happened. But now there's no label. I'm in charge of what I do. Well, there you so go. Yeah, yeah. Well, so. you know what? I mean, I'm sure it would have been a huge uh, hit for TLC, but what oh, it's, yeah. it's a stamp Definitely. Yeah. for Cherokee. Yeah, it is. Always tell people, look, don't be fooled by everyone wants a, a hit record. Right, yeah. But I, hey, I don't have a problem with a stamp. Right, exactly. Because a stamp is like, yeah. oh, no, but that's, oh, that's the else. The song else's. that I get people really uh, talking about is I Swear and... Um, what was the one on my first album, um, Stepping Stone? Stepping Stone. Oh wow! Yeah, I get people, you know, telling me that that song has helped them, helped them move on, and because it's about uh, abusive love, right, you know? right. And a lot of women always approach me and tell me that that song helped them get out of their situation. So and you know that what? Feels good. Yeah, and, and actually, you know, they definitely should. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, go back and grab that again still today because we're still living in a time, yeah. you know, where, where we see a lot of and hear about a lot of uh, domestic violence yeah. um, in women and men, too. Right. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. And, and we, you know, people need something that's going to uplift their spirits. Right. And, and they should go back and, um, and grab that and, and, and let it still be something very important to them now. Right. Exactly. I mean, a song like We Are The World shouldn't be the only song. You know what I'm right, saying? Right. You're right. Spider, You're right. you know, yeah. something like that. Yeah. A song. If you got uh, a lot of positive response on that song for a right. new generation, there you go. Yeah. Grab them. Here's yeah. something for you. Exactly. I'm sure somebody's going through it. Yeah, that'll probably be a song that I add to the show once I you there know, you start go. doing the live show. There you go. Yeah. Well, I, I'll, when you do the live show, you invite me. I'm, what am I talking about? I hope she invite me. I'm out here. Oh, come on now. I mean, because I, 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 look, <laughs> every time I now. see you, I'm going to keep bucking for the drummer <laughs> job. Drum. If yeah. I'm in New York, that's your gig already. Yeah. You already well, why that? can't I be your like, drummer in LA? I can fly. If, I mean, you're going to be there. You're going to rehearse with me. You're going to Yeah, you know, I'll fly out. Come on, let me know. No, don't play, Bobby. Look, listen, don't listen. Play. Listen, y'all, I've been I've been bucking for a drumming job with Cherokee. Like, since all I, I really got to do is come on tour with Stessa Sonic. I'm just well, no, saying, listen, like, stop you know, playing. Like. Stop playing with us. You, you think I'm right. <laughs> I'm telling you. I get to open up. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Like. I'm telling you. <laughs> Neil will tell you. I said, yo, we doing... The, the Nile Rogers Fold it's the Nile Fold Festival. And it was us, Earth on the Fire, uh, what's the chick name? Kesha. Uh -huh. I said, yo, think Cherokee could play bass. And you was doing something though. You okay. weren't able to come. We was I think we was doing shake one of them. Uh, Shake uh -huh. Stadium on the ballparks or whatever like that. Right. And you couldn't do it. So I automatically thought of you. So there's right. no such thing as I would like to come up with Stats. Ain't right, no right. such thing. You're more than hey. welcome. Oh. Saying, I'm saying, I'm there, and I'm, 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 try, <laughs> I'm trying to convince Neil right now, the producer of your your composition, <laughs> your work, to give Stessa Sonic a Grammy track. That's done. That's done. He, he already got Grammys on his shelves already. <laughs> Step me the Grammy, yeah, but anyway, he got anyway. that Grammy for Outkast. Uh, exactly. Yep. yep. And he's about to get a Grammy for God. So anyway, we just want to put that out there so people please purchase it. It's online, Spotify. Show yes. your love to my girl, Cherokee. iTunes. Yeah, iTunes, all <laughs> that. Please show your love. Um, what are we going to expect from you now coming up now that the single is out? Um, I'm going to put the EP out probably in February. Okay. So that's going to be the next thing, six songs. I've, I've been debating on, like, album, EP. Of course, I know the fans want the album, but I think I'm going to do the EP first. All right, well, you know, cool. And then come with the album. Well, you know what so, kind of age we're living in now. I got we, some fun stuff coming. Yeah. You know, I'm coming back here in April to shoot a video called Oh, Old right. School. Yeah. So you doing a band scene or anything like that? Somebody for you need the, to play drums the, It's called Old School. So it's basically <laughs> like a Brooklyn vibe. It's like... <laughs> it's I'm going to buck like this whole a, interview, uh, Cherokee. <laughs> <laughs> I'm bucket for a job. But yo, yeah, I mean, hey, you can be in a video. You know, I have no problem with that. All right, so, well, cool. All you right. know, I love it's to show my face. It's the old school uh, vibe where I'm basically reminiscing on my childhood. Oh, okay, oh great. So it's a really cool song. Great. Yeah. Well, we're definitely looking forward to. That. I am one. I will say it again. Very, very proud of you. What you, what you're doing. What you're continuing to doing. Um, also, Thank thanks for sharing with us that the only the reason why you took a break because you wanted to be a, a family person, a mother. Yes, it's you know, important. Which is it's definitely important. very important. Yeah. Um, and we appreciate that. But we also appreciate the fact that you went back in the studio, did some new music. Goddess is the single that's out right now. Yes. Show the love. We know we're going back to the 1960s. It's all about singles nowadays. Right. You know what I'm saying? Before people, you know, Yeah, I'm thinking down. about doing some wax for a few of the songs, too. Really? Yeah. I think that'll be fun. You know? are, are you interested in working with other artists? Have you submitted songs for other artists today? Um, I've worked this. No, I haven't. But yeah, I'm interested. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, I have in the past. You know, right, right, I mean? yes, yeah. Yeah, in the past, I've I've had a song with Dwelle. Um, I had a song with Jaheem and mm -hmm. Mary J. Blige that did a, a track that I did with another producer named Malik. 
who wrote most of the song. I wrote, I co-wrote the song with him, but he did most of the song. Right. Pendleton. Um, so I'm down to work with other artists always. And you, you, you also, know. for people who don't know, you also played, performed with the legendary Sheila E. Yes. Please quickly that tell us about that. That was the highlight. I think that was the highlight of my career mm -hmm. so far. Mm -hmm. That and um, opening up for Lauryn Hill. Wow. Yes. There you go. But yeah, I did. Um, but you was I on time for the Lauryn Hill show, though, right? Oh, yeah. You was, was on time. You know, I got that gig. <laughs> you because, was on time, um, wasn't you? Me, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about you, Lauren, but I Cherokee was her. on time. Oh my God, I love Miss Hill. She's yeah, like, yeah. she's so amazing. Um, but it's crazy how I got that gig because I was on the festival as well, mm -hmm. but I was supposed to be on the next day, but oh. Black Eyed Peas canceled. Wow. And they had like 30 artists to pick from and they picked me. So I was like, cool. yes. So that, that was like, cool. that was amazing. Yeah. You know what? It was what? amazing for me. I, you know, again, a person with your talent, um, you blend in with everybody. Thank you. You know, you blend in with everyone. And again, we are looking forward to this new music that's going to be coming out in February. I suggest everybody go to her page. Go to her Facebook page. Go to her Facebook page. Go to her Facebook page. She says, go to her Instagram page too. But we want to keep on Facebook too, you know. So try to bother as much as you can on there. <laughs> Show the love. Purchase on Spotify, iTunes, all the social media yes. outlets. Yeah. Get that song, Goddess. Um, we're going to continue to play it here. And check the video out on YouTube and leave yes. a comment for me. Yeah, me know, yeah, yeah. tell them what, what yeah. you like from yeah. them. Like, leave what you leave like from a comment for me on YouTube. Let me know what you guys think, you know, because that means a lot to me. Right. And send me some DMs. I like to talk to you guys one-on-one. -on -one. There you go. Yep. See? She, she <laughs> said, send us some DMs. Now, I, I'm just, if not for y'all. Some people are like, get out of the DM. No, I'm like, come inside the DM. No, no, Let's no. Talk. I, I, it, it's Let's cool. Talk. People, people come in the DMs, but sometimes their conversation is a little bit different. And sometimes right. I'll be like. <laughs> well, you know when somebody's trying to go there. You yeah, know, exactly. Trying to go somewhere else. I'm yeah, like, it's like, I don't want to yeah. block no one, yeah. but if I got to block you. <laughs> right. Like my man did LeBron James from the net. No, I'm just not. I really think it's like how a person gets what the energy they give off. Right. You yeah, know? That, I don't exactly. really get too many clowns. No, you don't. And you no, know what? You 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 an artist who really never had any problems or any beef with any other artists in the no, music industry. No, not at all. You know, which no. is cool. I mean, what real quick because I I know I gotta let you go. But tell me, what do you think about some of the new artists and the new music today? In the, in, the, in, the, in the industry and what or what you see was going on. Um, I love uh, SZA. I love uh, was that her name? SZA. I love um, what's her name? There's a girl that's out right now. Damn, I feel bad for not remembering her name. You're not talking about LMA. Um, Buddha, British chick. I love her too. Okay, okay. <laughs> I love. Um, there's another girl. I love. I actually like. Um, um, what's her name? She just came out with that song. What's that song? I love her. Oh, her. Her. Okay. Neil knows all the artists that I like because right, right, right. it's in her. my Spotify. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm bad with names. No, no. I'm really bad with remembering their names. Well, well, but I, I want to put Cherokee on the spot. I have them all in my Spotify. Right. You know, I like them. But I like a lot of rap music too. No, well, you know. I do. It's some of them I like too. But, you know, you, you, you wish people will continue to come back to being creative yeah. in hip hop. Um, I don't like to stifle nobody's uh, uh, challenge on what they want to do on work. But right. you can tell when someone's being lazy and not being creative. And that's when oh, I get yeah. in the, and I start fighting. But I'm still an old school head. Oh, no doubt. Most no of doubt. the stuff that I listen to is right. old school stuff. Right. Because yeah. it, keeps you, it keeps you fresh to say, yeah. you know, I can always. Because it, it keeps you away from everything that's going on right now. So right. you won't find yourself trailing them. I like to escape and listen to other types of music. So I listen to Bollywood, and my kids are like, what are you listening wow. to? Wow. Yeah. Like, I blast Bollywood in the car. Like, I love Bollywood. I love house music, you know. So I listen to lots. I love African music, you know. Wow. Yeah, I love all different types of music. Well, as, as long yeah. as I've been friends yeah. with Chucky, I didn't know that one right there. Yeah. What, what about Chris Bowie? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. yeah. okay well, we got great musical taste up in this yeah. room up in here. <laughs> anyway, uh, thank you so much for taking the time to come hang out with me. Um, I'm hoping to get you back here again when you come to shoot the video. Doesn't mean that because we did this one doesn't mean you don't have to return. Oh, I'll always come back. Because by, by that time, yeah. EP will be ready. I'll be banging on your door. Yo, well, I'm, I'm just saying. <laughs> well, actually, I'll be, I'll be banging in your DMs and be like, what's up with the drummer spot? <laughs> I'm going to keep bucking. For that drummer spot, <laughs> Cherry Cow Square. Don't let me. Don't let me see you on some some on Soul Train Awards, something like that. And I see somebody back there playing drums. 
I got no, your I'm, number. I'm, I'm coming for you. I mean, you know, it's up to you. All right, all it's right. All, it's all on you. You. you better change your phone number. Y'all, y'all heard what I said. It's yeah. all on him. Yeah. So I'm just saying. I got the same phone number I've had for 20 years. That's, that is true. That is. <laughs> Somebody you, say they don't have my number. I'm like. Yeah, yeah. Because when you when you moved. <laughs> You still had the same number. Then when you move yeah. back, you still had the same I number. The same number. Because I do like my. Sometimes yeah. I do my Sunday. You know. I'm I'm always real. I'm always 100. Yeah, yeah. I'm no, never you're Holly right. weird. No, Even no. though I'm living in Hollywood, I'm never Holly. No, weird. Well, I, I, one thing I will say, you straight Brooklyn. You yeah. thorough. That didn't change. Yeah. She's definitely straight Brooklyn. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you, thank you so much, Cherokee, for coming to hang out. Thank you. Pick up the single right now. Goddess is available. Go on YouTube. Watch the video on YouTube and please. Please make a comment under the video. Tell her what y'all think of uh, the video and the song because she got more stuff coming out. Yep. And Cherokee is cool people. She can take constructive criticism too. I can take it. I can take yeah. it. Yeah. She can I take can constructive criticism because I know people like to put their two cents in it. Yeah, you know, everybody has their own opinion. Exactly. So it's all good. And I don't have a problem in listening it's too. It's all good. Now, I can say it's stupid. Right. <laughs> but I listen. <laughs> <laughs> but I listen. Right. <laughs> but it's all right, though. So definitely do that. Cherokee, thank you so much. You're welcome. I love you so much. Love you, too. Come, man. come back in April uh, when everything is done. Absolutely. Ladies and gentlemen, my homegirl from the one and only streets of Brooklyn, Brownsville, Bed-Stuy, Flatbush, <laughs> the one and only Cherokee. Frank Y'all don't man. disappear nowhere. Check it! <laughs> <laughs>
No, not no, just say you're listening to Bobby Simmons. Okay. You listen to Bobby Simmons. Yeah. Okay. Hey, this is Cherokee, and you're listening to Bobby Simmons on Party1019.com. Hey, this is Cherokee, and you're listening to my single, Goddess, on The Bobby Show. <laughs> Go back on The Bobby Simmons Show. Hey, this is Cherokee, and you're listening to my single, Goddess, with Bobby Simmons on The... Uh... <laughs> Hey, this is Cherokee, and you're listening to my single, Goddess, with Bobby Simmons on Party1019.com. Let's do that one more time. Okay. Yo, what's up? This is Cherokee, and you're listening to my single, Goddess, with Bobby Simmons on... Uh... <laughs> Hey, this is Cherokee, and you're listening to my single, Goddess, with Bobby Simmons on Party1019.com. Yo, what's up? This is Cherokee, and you're checking out Mike Check 1-2 with Bobby Simmons. That's it. Yo, what's up? This is Cherokee, and you're checking out one of my throwback jams on Party1019.com. <laughs> 